My name is uh, Mike Duckworth. Uh, I'm head of uh, regional sales uh, at uh, the uh, Nexus Systems Company, uh, part of uh, the KNDS Group. Um, and uh, we're here today at uh, EDEX uh, in Cairo. Um, <clears throat> our uh, mission is really uh, to highlight one of our core competencies, uh, one of the many core competencies of the Nexta Group. Uh, but that of medium caliber. And uh, behind me, I have a range of uh, in-service weapons, uh, medium caliber, uh, which we uh, are proposing uh, here in, uh, in Cairo. The 30 millimeter is, uh, the, uh, fires the 30 uh, 113 round of ammunition. It is the cannon that was developed to equip uh, the Tiger ground attack helicopter. The 25 millimeter below it is the uh, uh, cannon which was developed to equip uh, the French Army VBCI. At the bottom here we have the 20 millimeter, uh, which has uh, is uh, has been around uh, for, for many years, but it still uh, finds its place uh, in the marketplace. And frankly, there's a bit of a renaissance uh, with regard to 20 millimeter, because more and more uh, it is compared with the uh, firepower of the 12.7. Uh, the reality is that the 12.7 half inch uh, is a bit limited and the 20 millimeter offers uh, not much more uh, uh, encumbrance than a 12.7 but extends the, the firing range uh, significantly and a 20 millimeter round of ammunition being much more uh, effective than a 12.7. So, so far as the Renaissance is concerned, what we're seeing is a lot of interest, uh, particularly from special forces around the world. While these uh, weapon systems have been uh, developed with uh, particular requirements and to particular programs uh, in mind, uh, now what uh, we are doing as a company is uh, configuring these weapons in different mountings, uh, particularly as the tendency to uh, remote weapon stations is, uh, is uh, coming to the fore, uh, where customers are looking for more lethality than they can offer from the traditional 12.7. We're now developing and putting into service a range of uh, medium caliber weapon stations um, uh, based on uh, either the 30 millimeter or the 25 millimeter or indeed the 20 millimeter. So an example of the application of the 25 millimeter is uh, our ARCS 25 is a fully remote weapon station, uh, 280 rounds online, twin feed, uh, and something that uh, at the end of the day uh, we uh, have managed to uh, uh, secure some uh, first sales and uh, is uh, now entering service at this moment in time. So now we're uh, looking at the uh, Narval. Uh, the Narval uh, was uh, developed uh, initially uh, for the French Navy. It's based on the 20 millimeter and uh, on the large ships is uh, used as close protection. However, uh, what we found is that the very characteristics of the 20 millimeter, which was originally developed for air platforms, low recoil, low mass, mean that uh, in this remote configuration, uh, it is particularly applicable to uh, small, fast patrol craft. And uh, now we actually uh, have a very significant uh, number uh, uh, in service around the world in just that sort of application, from uh, 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 boats from uh, 20, uh, 20 meters in length, uh, all the way up to, uh, as I explained, uh, uh, protection uh, of, uh, of large frigates. In line with uh, the application of those e existing cannons, um, we see very much uh, a market opportunity uh, to use um, the cannon that was developed initially for the Tiger. Uh, so it fires the 30113. Um, we have the uh, turret technology. We are focused on uh, keeping uh, lightweight, minimum integration burden, and uh, as a result, in that uh, uh, in that sort of strategic direction of product development, uh, we're now uh, uh, working on proposing an ARCS in the ARCS series 30, and this time we will equip that with the um, cannon from the from the Tiger helicopter. 
I'm, we, although our intent is to uh, present that uh, formally uh, in hardware at uh, the upcoming uh, Eurosatory exhibition, uh, in fact, uh, it will also feature some uh, quite novel features, not only uh, those associated with the Canon, uh, but uh, I would prefer to uh, reveal those at, uh, at Eurosatory. Okay. Um, the role here is uh, to use the, uh, uh, the volume of the 30 millimeter projectile. Uh, we have, uh, through the ca capabilities of the group, uh, an opportunity to add uh, airburst to this uh, uh, particular round of ammunition. Uh, and we've got some uh, smart targeting that uh, we're working with some uh, 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 novel companies with uh, uh, to provide an innovative solution uh, for close protection. So that is the ARX-30 and uh, more on that uh, at Eurosatory in a few months time.